So show your work by Austin Kleon. Um, I think it is one of the most impactful books I have read um, about content creation because it just changes the whole idea of content creation. Most of us think about content creation as working towards a content, building a content, finishing that and then sharing it online. For example, if you're writing an article, you tend to first think about the topic of the article, you tend to do some research about the article, you write it after a lot of time when you complete writing the article, that's when you share it online. But in this book, Austin Cleon has shared a totally different approach. He says that why are you just sharing the final version of your work? Why not share your work during the course of its completion? So every stage of the completion, you share your work. For example, if I'm writing this article, I will not only share the final version of the article online, but I will share each and every stage which involved me writing that article. I will start with my research. Probably I will take a video of me researching the stuff. I will take a photo of the different sources that I'm using for researching it. Probably a newspaper, probably a magazine, all of that stuff I'll share online. Um, I will share a video of me writing the article. I will share a video of, of me probably researching the article online. So all of these things I will share it with uh, my followers. So this is basically the approach that Austin Cleon has taught in this book, Show Your Work. I will divide this video in three parts. The first part is the introduction. The second part is the methods of sharing. And the third part would be the conclusion. So in the first part, uh, let's talk about why you want to share your work. The reason to share your work is simple. You will be building an audience when you're sharing your work. The reason you build an audience is because when you are sharing your each and every stage of content creation, the audience understands how you're building the content. If you're just sharing the final version of your work, they just see that. But if you share each and every stage, they know that actually the whole stage, uh, the whole uh, process, how it goes about. And they're able to understand that, okay, he's only a human being. He's not just creating this stuff out of nowhere, but he's building the stuff in the whole process. The second reason is related to the first reason itself, that because people feel more connected to you, they will believe more in you. And tomorrow, if you were to monetize your content, if you were to share anything with people, they will believe you. If I'm sharing uh, my YouTube videos online, tomorrow, if I want to monetize my content, I can start affiliate marketing. But people will only buy my products, buy my stuff if they believe that I am a genuine person. Now let's talk about the methods of sharing. So the basic method of sharing that Austin Cleon has spoken about in this book is sharing each and every stage of your work, whether it is the start, whether it is the middle or whether it is the finishing stage, you need to share each and every stage. And in this process, the camera is going to be your best friend. You need to make sure that you're using the camera wherever you can. If you cannot use it, try to set someone else to use it and share each and everything which you can about your work. If I'm writing an article, I have so many things spread out on the table, isn't it? There is a newspaper, there is a magazine, there is a laptop, there is probably an iPad on which you're researching the work, there is a notebook on which you're writing. There are so many things to share and even then, what do we share? We just share the final version of the article. So don't do that. Just share each and everything which you are doing, each and everything which is helping you. Another method is not just sharing photos, but also sharing videos. Share a video of you working on something. If you share a video of you working on an article or you working on a YouTube video, uh, probably you can just talk about what you are doing, how your process is, how do you start with the process, how do you go about the process, what are the different stages of your process and how do you end up completing it. That will make the audience believe in you. They will understand that this is not something which is a magical process. It takes time and you actually put in so much effort and they will even believe more in you in the future. Probably they will uh, watch more of your content and consume more of your content because of this. To conclude, I would like to say that definitely if you're sharing your work online, you will be able to build a loyal audience and that is something which is invaluable. You cannot put a price on it and just 
read this book and it will change your whole perspective of content sharing online instead of just sharing the final version of your content you will be sharing each and every stage of your content creation so i hope you found this video useful and you will read this book it's a very short book and i'm sure you will complete it within a week and if you're a quick reader you will probably finish it within a day as well so read it and uh, i'm sure it is going to change your game of content creation that's all i had for this video thank you for watching i'll see you next time bye